Welcome guys. So in this video I'm showing you a SMS based electronic notice board. And uh, this is our uh, AVR microcontroller at Mega 32. And these are the uh, 8 bit shift resistors the 74 HC595 for selecting the dot matrix columns. And these are 7 LED dot matrix. And it is a virtual terminal for showing the communication happening between the GSM modem and the microcontroller. And it is a COM port through which the uh, GSM modem is interfaced with microcontroller and Proteus software. We have to select the COM port and the baud rate and stop bits, parity bits. So it is an initial message, a welcome message that is electronic notice board that is being displayed on the LED dot matrix since no message has been received. It is just for the first time. And in the virtual terminal window, you can see the communication happened between the microcontroller and GSM modem. Some AD commands sent from the microcontroller side and the response coming from the GSM modem. Now we'll make a call from an unresistant number uh, that is not saved in the microcontroller. Simply it is an unresistant number uh, which is not authorized to call or SMS. So the microcontroller will hang up the call and, uh, and send a message. You can see uh, this process in the virtual terminal window. Call coming from the unresistant number microcontroller will send the message uh, that uh, you are not authorized to make call or send SMS to this number. Now if a message comes from this number or any unresistant number then again microcontroller will delete the message and uh, send a message uh, that you are not authorized. Now we'll make a call from a resistant number. Again, the microcontroller will uh, hang up the call and send a message that uh, this time please send a text message to display to a resistant number. You can see in the virtual terminal window the call coming from the resistant number and the message sent from the microcontroller side that please send a text message. Now we'll send a message to uh, that I want to display on the LED dot matrix from this register number. And this is the message that welcome to innovate logics. The microcontroller reads it and the message is being displayed on the LED dot matrix. The message is uh, scrolling slowly in the software but in real time uh, it will scroll at a normal rate. So this message is uh, saved in the microcontroller memory. Now uh, if we uh, switch off the circuit the microcontroller uh, on Startup will read the message from the its internal EEPROM and display the message. Thanks for watching the video.